All right. You guys, um, Ash, do you ever use this? I have not. All right, so we're going to try to teach you guys how to learn how to use it. You're going to have a minute to do it as many times as you can. So there's different variations to do it. One basic one is letting it come back. Like, you, it hits here, it hits here, it hits here, and then you hit it. So that's one way to do it. You can just keep switching arms. Another way to do it is to let it, uh, just let it hit here, and then you immediately hit it right after. So. So you could just keep it going. Like you can even switch it up. So the whole goal is to kind of just keep it flowing without stopping. Just do it as many times as you can. We do it for a whole minute. This is kind of considered practice. Um, normally this is kind of like a little too high for me. So then I would step on here. Because you want to be kind of level with your, your eye. Okay. So this is better for me. Okay, Brandon's not going to need this. Angela right. and Kiel might even have to step on there. But you want it to be level with your eye. I want to basically, I want you guys to be able to do this like with ease as if it's just jump rope. It's just so easy, mm. like if you're not messing up, you can hit it any time. But you don't want it to fly around like this, you just want to come in a straight line. Okay. Okay? So we'll so have that go first. Yeah. I, I do first. Okay. So we'll give you a minute to try. Ready? Go. So interestingly enough, remember that back fist drill is very similar mm, to that. That's what I was going yeah, so, to Yeah, so it's very similar to that. So it's just kind of keeping that flow going. And right a straight line. You want to have it like hit like right here and hit, hit straight like this. Don't hit down too much, but hit straight. Keep your elbows up. Ready? Go. I think you're too close. Step back a little bit. Go.
little closer, is that good? It teaches you to relax and have rhythm. Yeah, yeah, I get excited. Brent, I can't see it anymore. Brandon, Brandon's pretty good at it, so you'll see how she, he does it. Brandon. Go. <laughs> Keep going, we got a little time. Burn it out. Oh, there you go, time. Anybody else want to go? Yeah. Again? Anybody else? Alright, All right, go ahead. And Brandon's got that nice circular motion. Go. Very, very symmetrical. Because another thing is if you tense up too much, you won't be able to do it for that long. Yeah. So it teaches you to not be too tense either. So have speed, but not too, not too tense, more relaxed, and then have rhythm. You know, so it's not like here, you don't have to hit it hard. So it's not about power at all. You know, this is just like rhythm, speed, relaxation. If you if you don't in the accuracy too, if you don't hit it in the right way, it's just gonna fly everywhere, so it's 
time. Ash, you want to try again? Yes, sir. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Let's get some practicing because we don't never use this that much. Mm -hmm. Go. You're getting it, though. Go ahead. Time. Angelina, Keel, anybody else want to go? Go ahead. No? Alright. Which platform? Time. Keel, do it one more time. And then Brandon, one more time. That's it. Go. There you go. Brian, go with no platform because you're tall, so you don't need that thing. This will be easier, I think. Go.
Time. Good job.